No content challenge day two was a failure <laughs> more than yesterday. Not just because I listened to music in the car and now that Beethoven clarinet trio is stuck in my head and has been playing on repeat <laughs> all evening, but also because I've been on my phone a lot just messaging friends. And man, just spending so much time messaging, unlike yesterday where I actually had some quality alone time, today I did not even have much of that. Also, my sister's cat Luna is staying over for a week, so she's scared because new environment and all that. Going to keep her separate from Mochi and Tigger. I'll show you Luna at the end of this video. So back to the no content challenge. It is not going well. I honestly don't know if I'm gonna continue this no ch content challenge tomorrow as well. Tomorrow I'm gonna be on the mastermind call with YouTube creators and then meet a friend afterwards, so I won't have much alone time even if I spend no time watching any content or reading any book. So man, I don't know. I don't know what I'm gonna do. My friend Niels was saying that I should just get back to a routine, use a calendar, and go hardcore on my routine. And that sounds like a good idea too. So I guess you'll see what I end up doing tomorrow, but my commitment to this no content challenge is wavering after today's failure. If I really wanna take it more seriously, I have to even stop using my phone just for messaging as well. We'll see what I do. See you tomorrow. 1% better every day, baby. Good morning. Good morning. Today, Luna's gonna come over. Hmm? Luna's gonna... <laughs> You're gonna bark at Luna. I better keep her separate in her room. Good boy, Tigger. Usually you scratch the couch. Luna's coming over today, Tigger. Uh -huh. You're gonna hiss at her or be afraid or something. It's really warm today. It's like five, six, seven degrees on a February, well, Celsius on a February day. That's. <laughs> I'm not complaining. Look who is a new member of the house for a week. Luna. Poor Luna. She's scared. She's hissing and meowing and... <laughs> what you was barking at her earlier. <laughs> Uh, it'll take a while for her to get used to this place, but she's only staying for a week, so... Hello, Luna. Hello, Luna. Oh, you gonna come out? <laughs> Brave cat? I don't think... I don't think Tigger would come out when he... First came here definitely was hiding for so long. At least Luna recognizes me, so not super scared. She's being very affectionate. Rubbing herself on me. Oh, she's laying by my foot. I better provide her company. Oh, wow. Coming onto the bed already? Brave cat. I better keep her company for the most part. Bring her into my room when I'm in my room. I'm not gonna let Moti and Tigger interact. I said it should be apart for at least a week and she's only staying a week, so they're going to be separate. Separated.
Tega. 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 Tigger knows there's Luna inside. <laughs> he's checking, he's checking Luna out. <laughs> uh, I'm sure they can smell each other. Tigger smelled Luna's blanket and then he started running away and now he's hiding under this table. <laughs> Tigger, so scaredy cat. <laughs> hiding after smelling Luna. Just a blanket. <laughs>